range anywhere between 30 and 40 pounds, males or females. They're not a real vicious cat or anything like that, but they, they do well with the, the regular domestic cat as far as breeding and uh, producing uh, the F1s is which what we want. <laughs> you can leash train them to walk just like a dog. They'll fetch like a dog. My name's Laura Williamson, and I'm the manager here at A1 Savannas. The first time we uh, really mess with the kitties is at three weeks, and uh, we health check them and name them and, and get their first picture. And we have a photographer here that uh, then takes the kitties and gets their photograph for the first time, and sometimes that's when we first put them on the website. Switzerland, um, England, France, uh, Brazil, uh, we've sent them to China, Russia. But A1 Savannas is one of the first places that uh, bred the hybrid Savannah cat from the African serval uh, with a domestic cat. And we have all generations here that we sell, so we make sure that we move males around to the females that need them. And because they are wild, um, sometimes they don't like the female because it's a male with a female, Savannah. And uh, so we have to watch him real close that, that he doesn't get too rough with her, things like that. But other than that, no, it's just the same as <laughs> the regular cat. <laughs> They've got very distinct markings, um, the big black spots and stuff like that that we're looking for, even at, at a baby age. And it's not in the hair, it's like a, it's clear to the skin, that spot is. So uh, you could shave their hair all off and they'd still have those spots. They get wet food morning and night, and they also get a, a chicken a drumstick um, at night as, as their little treat. So I take care of all of that, bringing kitties in for mamas after they're born, uh, shipping them out when they're ready to ship out, making sure they're good and healthy, and uh, any other problems with the kitties that we might have, I take care of.